Okay, hi guys, and welcome to yet another tutorial that I have for you this week. Uh, last week, I had, I had put a tutorial out on YouTube going over PS2 CD ISO images and how to convert them over to a DVD ISO image. That way you can burn them onto a DVD-R and play them on your modded PS2. But this week, I'm going to go over PS2 saves and how to download them onto your PC and then from your PC, converting them over to your uh, PS2 memory card. Now there's uh, one program that's going to be used to do this and that's this one here and it's called PS2 Save Builder. Now this will be under the description along with another link to where I get the PS2 uh, save files from. Now let's get started. Uh, first off you need to go to, your, to the website and once you get there it will look like this right here. And depending on the game save file that you want, you will pick between A to Z. And in my case, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with C for uh, Castlevania: Curse of Darkness. It's a really cool game. Uh, scroll on down to see your game. Mine's right here: Castlevania: Curse of Darkness. And what you want to do? You want to scroll over until you see the save right here. And that's what you want. So once you're here, you want to click on that, and it will bring you to this page. Now, depending on the save file you want, you have all these to choose from. I already have mine picked out. I'm gonna go with this save this game save game file right here, which is 32k in size. And what it says is it says first save point. All materials times 99, all armors, all hems, all accessories. So, that sounds pretty good to me, so that's the one I'm going to go with. So once you uh, have one picked out, you can go up here and you just click on this right here. And it will automatically save it for you, probably in your download section like mine. So after that, you can clear out of this. You can go to your uh, download section, which mine's right here. Actually, I have two of them. I've done it once before. But you, what you want to do is just drag it to your desktop. Let me close that out. Now, this is where your uh, your program comes in, comes in handy right here. What you want to do, open it up and run it. That's what this looks like. What you want to do, go up here to File, and go to Open. Now you have to find, in my case, mine's on my desktop. So I'm going to click the desktop, and I'm going to scroll on down to see my file. It's right here. I'm going to click it. Now this is very important. What you want to do, you want to, you want to create a folder. Okay, just like that. Now, what you want to name this folder is what you see right here, okay? What you want to do is basically highlight this, copy it, go up to your folder and click on rename, and then just simply right click and paste. And that's exactly what you want to do for it to work. And then after that, once you get your, all, your folder all set up, what you want to do Come down here to your these are your files. What you want to do is highlight all these files. Right click and extract. And what you want to do, find your folder that you just named and created, which is this one right here. Click on that and then go and just click save. And they should should have been saved into your folder. Just like that right there was perfect. So now that we have our folder with all our files in it, we can clear out of this. And you can simply just delete this. You don't need this anymore. Now what you want to do, you want to you want to plug in your uh, your flash drive. <laughs> what what you're going to do, you're going to simply just uh, uh, cut and paste pretty much or you just kind of drag it over 
to your flash drive, just like that. And the next step is uh, going to your PS2, and I will I will show you here in a minute on how to do that. So let's let's go on over uh, to our PS2. Okay guys, now the first thing you want to make sure you do is to plug your flash drive into your modded PS2 and we'll go ahead and turn that on. As you can see I do have Freemic Boot installed on my PS2. Once it gets loaded up, now you want to go down to your U launch and go into your U launch. And you just hit your O button, go into your browser. What you want to do is go to your flash drive. Just, just uh, go down to math. That's your flash drive right there. And hit your O button. Now, here's that file that we had created on the computer. What you want to do, you want to hit R1 and you want to come over here. It just it brings up this menu. What you want to do is go to copy and hit O button. Now you will see a, a green square lit up on the uh, right hand corner up at the top. That means it's copied. And you go back up to your folder, hit hit the O button. Now what you want to do is scroll up to your MC0 folder and go into it hit 0 your O button and now don't scroll down or anything just leave it right there at the top uh, hit your R1 button to bring your menu back up and go down to paste and hit your O button and that should uh, paste it onto your me memory card And now if you see, this is the one that we had created. It is now our memory card, and now we're insert our game. As you can see, I do have the original game here. I don't know if you can see that. But we'll go ahead and insert this. Start it up. It'll take a few seconds. All right, here we go. Me. Okay, now we're going to go to continue. Memory card slot one. And there's a file right there Hector Vandy Castle. First floor. That is the first save point. As you can see, this is the safe, the first save point. What we'll do, I'll go into the menu and show you. Okay, menu. You go to item. Now I should have a lot of these things. I should. You see, I've got every one of these. All the rare items. The material, I got all these, 99 of every one of them. And if I go to equip, I've also got 99 of every one of these. Armor, 99 of each one of these.
go here. 99 of all these. So I'm pretty, I'm pretty, uh, 99 of all these. I'm pretty much ready to go, to tell you the truth. And, uh, that's my tutorial, guys. Thank you once again for watching. And I hope this helps you guys out once more. And we'll see you on the next video. Thanks.